Larry Vickers here at OpsCore 2019 SHOT Show. I'm with Greg. He is the product manager for OpsCore, and they've got a brand new product we want to send your way. What do you got, brother? So this is the Adaptive Mission Platform Communications Headset, Larry, or what we like to call it as AMP. So it's a game-changing headset that's going to completely change the world of comms. This headset, when you put it on, it's not just protecting your hearing, it's enhancing your capability. So what you have is a 360 degree full situational awareness when you put in this headset. You can actually tell what direction sound is coming from. Not only that, you can actually boost your hearing 12 dB. So Larry, imagine you're in a stack out in a hallway, right? And you need to hear what's going on in the room. You can actually boost up your hearing and get a little sneak peek of what's in there. The headset, aside from that, can be used with these earplugs right here. These are NFMI earplugs. It stands for Near Field Magnetic Induction. This cable is not necessary, it's just a retention cord. These don't take batteries and there's no wires involved whatsoever. You put in these earplugs, you press this button right here on the left ear cup, your situational awareness and your comms will transfer into the earplug. So now you have double hearing protection of 34 dB NRR. Say you're on a helo, right? No more crushing your head with your ear cups to be able to hear your guys, right? Say you're doing a breaching operation, just cracking off sharp barreled rifles indoors. You actually now have adequate hearing protection with full situational awareness. Underneath on the back side of the ear cups, you'll notice there's no cables. The headset's fully connectorized now. So what this means, if you're a single down lead guy, you can run that. If you're a left-handed shooter, you want to pop it over the other side, you can. If you want to run dual down leads, you can. If you're training, you can just take it off altogether. Also, the boom mic can be swapped from ear cup to ear cup. Or, once again, if you're training, it ships with an extra plug, you can just pop it in there and cover it up. The other port that's not being used for the boom mic can be hooked up to a uh, gas mask or an O2 mask. The headset can be quickly detached from the headband. You have these three tabs right here. Cable comes around. You have these cable management straps right there. Put the ear cup in your hand. Pops right off. And now your headband's not destroyed. You can use it again later. We have our rail attachment kit. And it goes right for the helmet. Yep, mounts right back here to the back portion of the helmet. This actually locks your helmet onto your head better. Imagine you're running night MVGs, right? This is actually providing counterbalance and stabilization of your MVG system. Question, you guys are really known for helmets. Where did this, was this an end user driven thing? It was an end user for a very specific customer, which we won't answer right now. I'm sure it'll be public knowledge soon, but this is gonna be one of their new headsets. Yeah, because this is kind of new. You guys really didn't get much into the comm side of the house, so, right? So, actually a little secret about Gentex, right? We have been making US made boom mics for a long time. If you look at some of your headsets, you pop off the foamy, you're probably gonna notice Gentex on that label. So we've actually been in the comms business for a long time. Got it, and this was just an expansion of that. Correct. One thing I noticed is playing with it here at the show was you can still have a conversation even with, I mean, loud noise like gunfire. Absolutely, so say you're on a 50 cal machine gun, right? Or even uh, some of the large bore precision rifle guys, we can actually be still having comms even over that high noise environment. So unlike uh, some other headsets that have a gate, when you trigger that high impulse noise, sometimes they cut off the volume altogether. This has, it's what's called a soft knee compressor or limiter. It just brings the audio level down to a hearing safe level, but Larry and I can be still talking and there's a fast recovery in between the impulses. Yeah, I, that was impressive. It's, it's really a game changing headset. Uh, you know, people joke online when we announce it. So you basically created a headset that can do everything. Now, these available now? Shipping now, right now on the website. There's actually a discount code for our shop people, S-H-O-T on, uh, on there, it'll give you 20% off. Cool. Now, I understand you got some other stuff you want to talk about. Absolutely. Uh, we're going to hand you off to Ray Bennett. He's going to walk you through some uh, other interesting things. Thank you, bro. Anytime. Thank you, Larry. All right, I'm here with Ray Bennett, Ops Core, and he's going to take us through a couple other items. What do you got, brother? I'll do. 
Thanks, Larry. What I'd like to show you next is the, uh, the OpsCore Fast SF helmet. This is our top of the line special operations helmet. It's a super high cut helmet. Uh, OpsCore has for a number of years made this the SOCOM standard helmet. And what we did with the SF was take it up a notch in a number of different ways. So to start with, the helmet is, is 8 to 10% lighter depending on the size, critical for the operator to not have any more head weight than necessary on the head. And then we started adding functional features to the helmet. Uh, first and foremost up front, we have our modular bungee shroud, lightest weight shroud on the market. Uh, features bungees that are built right in, so you don't need to draw them from the side of the helmet, so there's less snag hazards to be involved there. It also has a removable plate, so depending on your mounting system, you can interchange that uh, without having to take the shroud off the, off the helmet. Moving over to the side, we have our, our traditional super high cut arc rails, which is again an industry standard for attaching things to the side of the, the helmet. We've added a shim, and the shim goes between the helmet and the rail, and allows us to attach some other accessories, like this ballistic mandible, without having to take up any more rail space. So you have that preserved for lights and other things. So the manual snaps right on like that, you get the protection and you still have your rail space free for other accessories. Obviously the Velcro pattern is new uh, on the SF, giving you more coverage so you can attach things in different places, also breaking up the signature of the helmet a little bit. Moving around to the inside, we're featuring our vented Lux liner. So super comfortable, super adjustable liner. Comes with three different thicknesses of pads, quarter, quarter inch, half inch, and three quarters of an inch. So you can get a really custom fit for a maximum comfort. And we also have the universal Nate pad, which is an accessory that's designed to hold the back of your head so that your night vision goggles can be better stabilized while you're using them. Also comes with a standard Nate pad, so you're free to not use that if you don't want to. Have our, our uh, low profile Oct dial, which allows you to tighten it up. And then last but not least, the OpsCore standard headlock chin strap, which gives you two directions of pull on your chin to stabilize the helmet and one-handed adjustment, uh, which is really fantastic on the helmet. So the Fast SF, uh, really our top of the line helmet and, and uh, really in that. New for this year? Yes, well, we, we launched it last year and, uh, and we're really getting it, getting it going here. Cool, yep. good deal. So the other thing I wanna to talk to you about is new for SHOT Show. And that's our Mark I Performance Protective Eyewear. Gentex, for a lot of years, for over 50 years, has been a pioneer in polycarbonate lenses, really one of the innovators of that, and has been an OEM supplier to a lot of the big name glasses companies over, over time. We do a lot of work with uh, aircraft visors uh, and other optical products. And what we wanted to do is offer a, an eyewear that's a little more accessible to folks to be a showcase for that technology. And with the Mark Ones, we've really done that. So the Mark I's feature an aluminum construction, really durable, also adjustable to your head shape, so you can sort of bend them, get them to, get them to fit. They fit nicely under ear protection and things like that. And what's really neat is they've got an interchangeable lens. So I can pop the lenses right out and change them out for one of our other lenses, which include tint, high contrast, and laser dazzle, which will protect you from visible lasers. Now obviously for defense customers, we work on a lot of advanced laser eye protection as well, and we have solutions for those customers too that can be adapted into the Mark I solution. So we're really excited about getting the Mark I eyewear out there at SHOT Show and glad to have the chance to show them to you. When do you expect those to be shipping? These are shipping now. Hey bro, thanks to Maine, I appreciate it. Thank you, Larry. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We got more coming your way from 2019 SHOT Show. LAV out.